from the station that's in your corner. You're watching Fox 4 News at 10. Hurricane forecasters from Colorado State University revealing their hurricane forecast today. They say they expect a slightly above average hurricane season with 14 named storms, seven hurricanes, three of which are expected to be major hurricanes. But with the strong season so close to starting, four in your corners, Tony Sadiku went to one of the areas hit hardest by Hurricane Irma here in southwest Florida to check on how they're rebuilding their community still. Tony. Amy, last year, Hurricane Irma ended a 12 year hurricane drought in southwest Florida with the strongest hurricane Florida has seen since Wilma back in 2005. This year, who knows? But people in the Bonita Springs neighborhood I visited today there still are shaken by the devastation Irma did. We're helping another homeowner here recover from Irma. More than six months after Hurricane Irma ripped through southwest Florida, they rebuild. Lady lost her roof right inside of her house, and uh, she's a widow, lives by herself. And the roof blew off. The wind came from the north, and right behind me here, just blew this section off. And even when the odds were stacked against her. So she's been fighting with her insurance company for six months. Ray Junta and his team of volunteers won't stop working, cleaning, and rebuilding. It got destroyed, but you know what? Irma's not the last word. 68 homes later, they're still committed to making sure people's lives are restored. People come together and do what's right. And what's right today is to put a roof on that house for that lady. For weeks after Hurricane Irma, water from the Imperial River behind me filled the street so much so that you couldn't even see this pavement, let alone drive into this neighborhood where dozens of homes were badly damaged. We have about 600 homes in here, and there was only about 100 that maybe were spared either the wind or the water. So just about everybody got touched with something. Now they fear another storm like Irma. Does it scare you to think, you know, that something like this could happen again? I don't want to think about it. And with forecasters from Colorado State University calling for another above average season this year, Junta says the key is to have a plan. Um, because it's not, you know, if it's going to happen, it's just only when it's going to happen. You know, do not underestimate the power of these storms. And for information on how to get ahead of this year's hurricane season by creating a plan, go to our website, fox4now.com. Tony Siddiqui, Fox.